Hey there, fine audience, you're just in time. Today we are discussing the clip time panel in Resolute Arena and Avenue. For this tutorial, I'll be demonstrating the clip time panel in Resolute Arena. The clip time panel displays time-related data, which is super handy for tightly scripted shows where everybody needs to get their timing right. To display the panel, navigate to the view menu and select show clip time. The panel will be placed in your interface. But because it is a panel, you can freely move it to a spot that suits you best. Alternatively, you can undock the panel by right-clicking the header and selecting Undock. By clicking on the cogwheel, you can adjust what the panel displays. System time will display the current time. Selected clip displays the remaining time of the clip currently selected. Selected layer displays the remaining time of the active clip on the currently selected layer. And finally, there are individual layers that can be monitored without you needing to select them. Note that I said remaining time, but this is something you can change too. By clicking on the time indicator, you can switch between the remaining time and the current time. Remaining time will be indicated by a minus symbol in front of the time indicator and tells you how long it will take until the end of the clip. The current time has no special symbol and simply shows you for how long a clip has already been playing. You can set the display mode per clock, but not for system time, as remaining time on the system clock will be profoundly depressing. One final note before you wrap up this tutorial. The clocks will adjust to the color of the clip and or layer that is being monitored. For example, when I color this layer blue, the clock will be blue too. With all these options, it's really up to you how to use this panel, and how you use it will be completely dependent on the kind of show you're doing. That was all for this tutorial. I hope you have learned something today. Please let us know how you are using the clip time panel in the comments below. Links to the footage used in this tutorial can be found in the video description. And I will see you in the next one.